Kawai ka seng ka barang shustang mi parthai ka bala tip karteng kum ka Youth Voice for Human Rights Organization ka badai ka seng jogi samla puli bakan thup ru yaki muktiar kiriu shampang bat kiwe kiwe kalapan pawi ya ka jing smok ya halor ka jing duno ki khna ayala ka hok ha ka bai dei bat ka puli ka puthi ka jing pentrai jubor ha ki yeng briu ki kar khna bat kham tam e ya ka jing e ki kenthai ni ka domestic violence kani ka seng ka barang shuseng men ha ka ar punyo tri unai lor a har jagat sao kalapan rem jur ya ka jing ja ka bala ja men ha ka ar punna tri ujumang Haka bala pala lai pungut ki briu gila syakti hagi pulit Bakan thup jika riu kentai bagi senrang Hadin bala wano ka jengalang bala pelong Daka hinyo trap youth council Hamaran laban sports club Haba ya keren bagi lat patah kubor Usam na HM ding do Presiden kenega kenhun Ula pendam juri ka jengle cengki pulit Daka bakan no Bakan ni ka jengle ki pulit Kalong ke bom laban pedang setia Bat kalong kumba yurot no Ela ka hoki riu kentai Namar bagi pulit kila tiat napang Klem kenciu i gilong kemi Ki kentai Bat wat ya kitu giriu pak bak Ki bala syuyak lenti na kata ke jaka For the very simple fact is that being a new organization, we want to launch this organization. My question here is this. We have been living in a place where the rights are being violated each and every day. Take into account the atrocities that was done by the police department on that uh, day when the HYC uh, rally was there. I mean, the police department should have acted in a more civilized manner. That's our stand. Beating, having a lot of charge, especially on the head, that's uncounted for. So on part of the organization, first of all, we condemn the action of the police department on that day. And we also want to say this, on launching this organization, Kibun ba aki kibun ba ngingi hapan dia kong yui. Kung karaik yung information ay, kabal ngingi na don, tas lang ba. Itik bakit at ay kala don, ba ukhang na paro ako lang ban, let's sa kisko ni, kumalik si puli. Hindi rin itik, hindi rin itik yung kata. Kamtam siya nong gandong, hindi rin itik yung kata. So for more organization, we stood up and we will stand up for that cause. Where every child in Megalia should have a right to education, they must go to school. Then we also have an issue on child labor. On a research done by the organization, by the research uh, committee, we found this. In, in fact, uh, in, uh, in spite of having a child labor act, We still have a lot of children below 14 years of working. I call for a movement right now in Shillong. I call for a movement among the youths. I call for a movement among the people where we should fight for this. Because the government alone cannot do it. The NGOs alone cannot do it. We, everyone in Nepal, should do something in rescuing these children, putting them in school, getting them back with their families. That's what we wanted. And there's one issue that's rampant in Megalia, where we feel that in, as in the organization we feel that it needs to be abolished. So we want to make a stand clear today. Domestic violence is one issue in Megalia that's rampant throughout. I would say almost 50% of houses where women are victims of domestic violence. Therefore, I urge upon the people, various NGOs and the government to see into it that a stringent law must come. And not just that, that domestic violence must be abolished in paper and spirit. We cannot just abolish in paper, we have to abolish it in practice. These are, these are very, some of the issues that our organization stands for. And I also would like to say this. I call upon the youths of Megalia, being a young organization, an organization which is run by youths, run by lawyers, run by male scholars from Nehru. My opportunity here is to call on the youths of Megalia, the youths of Shillong, to stand up for their cause. 
There are many issues that must stand up. Many issues that we must interpret that falls under the violation of human rights. I would like to call each and every individual who are interested in us to come join this organization. Let us start a movement for human rights that each and every one, each and every individual will be respected. Their rights must be respected, must be defended. And if someone doesn't do it, we cannot wait for someone. We should do it. So this is the time where this particular right, for example, the domestic violence, no one is there to stand up. We must stand up. So I call all like-minded people, all like-minded individuals to come and stand up for this cause.